Okay, this is elevator modification part five. This is video a thousand and um three hundred and thirty-two, but it's not gonna be that number in the future. It's only temporarily and I'm gonna I'm not sure if I'm gonna I'm, if I'm gonna give it of my just the numbers on the videos of every single video I'll just keep them like that. Four thousand twenty one. But yeah, now we're gonna take the cab out and work on the cab and have more stuff to modify. You know, modify the new flyer bus. And it's stuck, but first you pull the store out, slide it out, take this and you just pull it apart. Just pull it like that. Put that side okay then so do you have some this part isn't too good you know fix this here and this tape is falling apart and as soon as the door rubs on this thing it just begins to like squeak so you know replace put another piece of tape or cut this one I'm just gonna cut this one, just tear it apart. And I'm just gonna take this piece of tape and try to force it inside. Now, if you're gonna do, if you're going to put tape in the track, you have to make sure you squeeze the tape inside. So that way, the door won't end up getting stuck between the tape, between the thickness of the tape. So like that. So this is how it should be. See like that. I don't have a tripod, unfortunately. And we end up with these small ripples, but I don't think I don't think that should be a problem. Let's take a look around the elevator. Okay, this part isn't too good. And this tape needs to be replaced. So take this off and throw it in the trash can. Now, unfortunately it has to be like that because if the tape sticks 